All right, guys, hey, this is Aaron. And Daniel. From the Coin Boys, and we're here with Artifact as well as Wax. And they got some really unique stuff going on right now. And so before I get into it a little bit, I'm going to let Steven take it and just kind of explain what's going on. Here you go, Steven. Sure, how's it going? So Artifact is the future of sneakers. We're mixing eSports with a high sale of technology, using cryptocurrencies to back the trading, creating secondary resale values of the sneakers, but having the craziest designs in the world, pretty much, using the best skin designer in the game, Chris Lee. Uh, using the best technologies and then we've got Evan here who su Wax is supporting our platform so our shoes will be all blockchain based so when people purchase them they can trade them instantly so no more waiting for shoes to arrive you can get the shoes straight away transfer them trade them get the physical shoe so it's a crazy new brand so super I, I have a real quick question Let's because of that, cause that uh, so are we trading the physical shoe or are we trading a digital shoe how is this it, work? it basically that works as both so we're creating sneakers as a currency so the shoes are sold online, you buy the digital digital sneaker, and then as soon as you receive it, you have the option to trade it because the resale value will be there. So it's like a digital asset. And then secondly, you can exchange a digital shoe for the real physical shoe, which is like, a, like the brand's called Artifact. It's like a museum artifact that has a great value and can be resold and traded. So we're making sneakers into stocks using the Wax platform, which Evan can cover a bit more of the like techie stuff through there. Yeah, sure. Evan, can, can you let us know a little bit about how Wax is coming uh, plays into this honestly I'm gonna just tell you Stephen did an insanely good job of explaining that was pretty concise that was yeah. great yeah so yeah really um, you know we partnered with these guys because they're literally the best at kind of each of their individual sectors in the game like we've been working with Chris Lee on skins for I don't know years now mm -hmm. and then Stephen's probably the best you know cut and sew shoe guy in the entire game so when they came to us with this concept of hey guys we want to make kind of this new generation this whole kind of new paradigm shift in the sneaker drop game I mean, it was a no-brainer for us, and we had the kind of perfect technology platform of blending digital and physical to kind of enable that, right? So we used the Wax blockchain to tokenize their shoes. Mm -hmm. So we put them on a token that's a digital token, but they're backed by real shoes. So they can move as easily as a token. <laughs> Sorry. Backed Proof by shoe. real shoes. Proof I love shoe. this. Yes, that's right. Excellent done. Yeah. Uh, Maybe you guys just coined something for us, right. huh? <laughs> but, uh, but so, uh, so it's, it, uh, is the physical... Can I connect a specific token to a specific shoe? Is that how it's working? Yeah, so basically, their shoe on our platform, you wouldn't know the difference, right? It doesn't look like a coin, it's not a currency itself, it's literally like a viral. If you're familiar with our technology, the kind of dApp that we've been utilizing, which is, you know, you're taking consumer products and you're basically tetherizing them, right? So you're making something that's digitally tradable, digitally transferable, right? So we can get their shoes, mm -hmm. I can have them, I don't have to actually ship them to myself until whenever, right? But I have the AR scan, I've got all the stuff, you know, important to me. And then I can go and turn around and flip it online. I can, you know, trade it to my friend. I can do anything instantly around the world. So it that's changes kind of the, the whole game, uh, the sort of sneaker culture, like gamer culture, how people like flex their skins in games. Mm -hmm. You don't need to physically have the shoe with you. You go on your our app and it'll, it'll show you the shoes you own. So that releases sort of AR animations that, I don't know if you've seen our Instagram videos, so people can create content with the shoes without physically having them. So that mitigates the problem of kids who don't have space to display these expensive shoes or they're worried to get them stolen. They can have them on the blockchain, they can physically show them off on social media through digital like technology that we're doing with AR, VR, and then if they ever want the shoes physically, they exchange it for the physical item. So very futuristic, very cutting edge, and it's the future of what we're doing. So yeah. as soon as we launch a shoe, it'll sell out very quickly, and then the secondary value will increase, which will promote trading, like Supreme do when kids buy stuff just to resell. So this will be a whole new currency for kids, basically. It's digital assets for the new age of generation of eSports. Will this also help with, uh, one, I know one of the big problems in, in you know, any kind of brand, any kind of physical yeah. brand, is uh, counterfeiting. Right. Is this gonna so we have tons of experience with that. With the blockchain and everything, the yeah. shoes can be exactly tracked. So when you receive it, you can confirm it on the app if it's legit or not. So no counterfeit problems with that. So all the shoes even will have USBs in them, some of them, the legendary ones, where you can plug into your iPhone to verify <laughs> it. So counterfeits aren't a problem with us. Really? And yeah, I mean, not to mention, right, so we have that whole blockchain explorer, you can see, you know, like you could on an Ethereum transaction, mm -hmm. the Genesis block will be artifact, right? So, yeah. I mean, we have a direct partnership with them where the shoes are coming from the source, they're from Steven, so there's absolutely no risk of, you know, authenticity fraud or anything of that nature. So, yeah, I mean, it's kind of like Steven alluded to, it's kind of the best possible way to, I, to kick off, you know, drop culture and immediately flip things, trade them and really, you know, grow the hype around them. Another thing is like the shoes are made in an artisan workshop. So it's very high level people, similar to how LV produced their stuff. 
So the yeah. counterfeit, we've had issues in the past with our shoes, with replicas, but they can't get to the quality we have as, like the shoe there takes 30 to 40 hours to create. And replica companies, they make use cheaper materials. So using the quality of our shoes is very difficult to replicate them. I mean, look, man, I'm as excited about this partnership as I am about any other. I mean, I love yeah. this, this team. I love the product. I think it's genuinely new. Um, we definitely have some other stuff coming up. And I mean, coming to E3 for us is obviously important. You know, gaming is yeah. the core of our business. Uh, we need to keep our finger on the pulse. We're meeting with all sorts of people. So totally. this is really a, you know, a big work week for us as well. Yeah. Uh, try to enjoy it as much as we can, though. Well, cool, guys. Well, thank you guys so much thank for your so time. Much. That's really amazing. And I'm glad you guys got to come here and enjoy your first E3. And, and I think this partnership has really got something here. And we'll, so. be, we'll be coming back yeah. to the Coin Boys real soon, guys. All right. Thanks, guys.